Hi, hi everyone, how are you going? It's uh, Saturday the 13th of uh, November 2021. I just want to share, I didn't realise, I knew there was a train line that ran along here because there's Jumlin train station up here. I knew that was there because I've been to that train station. But I didn't know that the railway still extended all the way out here. It does go out to the, well it used to go out to the port down here. This is where the cruise ships come in and dock, right here. Um, okay, so this whole section here, there's 30 uh, hectares. All of this here. And uh, here. Meninda Railway Station is an abandoned station on the Pingamara Railway Line, just 8.7 kilometres, 5.4 miles from the Brisbane Central District, 13.4 kilometres from Central Station by rail, closed as a staff station in 1930, reopened as an unattended gate in 1931 with full closure on the 27th of September 1993. The name Meninda comes from the English word Meninda, after twisting and turning route of nearby river. Meninda Railway Station falls within the suburb of Pingamara. The line to Pinkenbar opened on the 1st of April 1897 due to World War I and World War II troops camp camps were located in the area because of the deep berthing available to the ships at Pinkenbar on the mouth of the Brisbane River. Passenger ships of the Orient Steam Navigation Company and later P&O used the Pinkenbar Wharf and special trains ran from Brisbane. A station mistress was withdrawn and the station was closed in the 1930s due to economic measures brought on by the Great Depression. With public outcry by local residents and workers of the Commission Davison, the station was reopened in 1931 as an unattended gate. The HMS Nabriki Mobile Naval Air Base and large Army Camp Defence Storage and Warehouse Facility were located near Mininda Railway Station during World War One. Uh, World War II, sorry. The army camp remains today as the Damascus Barracks, and this is that here. So this section, all this big square, is Damascus Barracks, the whole thing. And there used to be a spur line, railway line, that used to come up here. I was looking on all the old maps before, and it used to come all the way up here, and go up to here. In 1988, part of the Pinkin line was electrified. However, only as far as Eagle Farm Station. Diesel hauled passenger service and stainless steel carriage infrequently operated as passenger services through Minda. All passenger service on the line was suspended on the 27th of September 93 by the Gross. Goss Labor Party government rationalization of the state railway network with the sup suspending or closing of unprofitable and underutilized railway lines. All that remains of Minda railway station today is the original low level platform. I had a replacement bus service so that's in 1899. And this right here is where that railway station was so it's really close proximity to this here. There was a spur line, like I said, that went up this way. But I don't think there's much there anymore. Like you can could see a sort of raised platform. And then there was another one just down here. This was the Pinkenbar railway station. 